Some radio stations are helping to feed Mainers in an unusual way. They're camping outside of Sam's Club in Augusta. News Center Maine's Ann Baldridge takes us to the parking lot party. Usually it's their listeners who are on the move when they're tuning in. 92 Moose, it's Matt and Lizzie in the morning live at Camp Out Hunger. But this week, Lizzie Snyder and Matt James are not in the studio. They're spearheading Central Maine's largest food drive. The goal? to stuff an 18-wheeler. We thought, let's live in front of a store that sells non-perishable food in bulk, and let's do it for a week and see what happens. For the fifth year, they are not only collecting donations and doing their show live from the parking lot, they're also camping out there for the duration. A lot of the people that come and donate have, are, have been hungry before and that haven't been able to feed their kids. So this is above and beyond what we, you know, I, I would sleep in a tent. All of the donations are going to a local Salvation Army, where they say this time of year, food insecurity is at its peak. The, the impact that this event has on people locally is immense because we have a small food budget at the Salvation Army here and the food that we raise here at this event goes all the way from now through almost into next summer. From Tuesday to Saturday, Lizzie and Matt will be here taking donations. Last year, they raised about $200,000 worth of non-perishable items. This year, they want even more. Well, the need keeps getting bigger every year. Uh, people have to think about, are we heating our homes or are we feeding our family? Uh, so we want to be out here to sort of paint that picture, make it a little bit more realistic of what food insecurity security in the state of Maine really looks like and helping one broadcast one donation at a time in Augusta and Baldridge New Center Maine